This is Anthony with Kensington Protective Products and I'm about to show you the Super Mesh Neck Warmer. This is fully waterproof and breathable. The Kensington Neck Warmers, what a lot of people like about them is the actual fit because they come so far back into the blanket that actually when the horse is grazing and putting its head down, you don't have to worry about the water coming back. A lot of people get cheap when they're making these and they do this really short neckline. It almost just meets up right with the edge of the blanket. So anytime the horse is actually being a horse, then you got the whole thing, the whole neck exposed. So that's why we give you this huge area just to give you more coverage so you never get water going down in this area of the blanket. This is our super mesh and what that means is we actually take our textiling fabric which is used on our protective sheet and then we sew it over a 1200 denier waterproof breathable fabric and then we use our hollow fiber fill. On the interior you'll see it's lined with nylon. It comes with three blanket hood connectors so you can have it at each point one on each side one in the middle and it comes with these under the neck you actually have four double locking velcro double locking velcro it's extremely hard for another horse to get this off your horse or for your own horse to get it off your own horse one way two way so this strap is sandwiched between two areas grabbing it most people just use one we use two they are not going to be able to pull this through. Also, in the construction of our neck piece, we have this extra area, this panel, which is underneath the neck, so there's no opening. So when the neck piece is underneath it, it goes over it, so it's, it fits like this under the neck, not edge to edge, allowing the breeze and the water to get under the neck. Most durable, most waterproof, best neck warmer we make, the most extreme winter conditions. I thought it would be really cool to do a tear test so you can see how strong the Kensington Textiline really is. I got a couple things here. I got the Kensington Textiline, I got the competitor's PVC junk, and I got 1200 denier, which most people consider to be a pretty strong fabric. So, what I'm gonna do, instead of me tearing, or trying to tear this stuff, that's not very impressive, so I'm gonna get someone just a, with a little more muscle than me. RJ, come on down. How's it going, Anthony? So this is RJ. Howdy. We're gonna give RJ the textiline to try and tear. All right, okay. that's the textiline. That's good. This is the competitor's PVC junk. Okay, that's the difference.